Hello everybody, and today I'm going to be showcasing a long over review of Waken Hatrix. I have not done this. I don't know why I didn't do it. I didn't want to do it because it got nerfed. Then it got buffed again, but I never got around to doing it. So we're, I'm doing it today. Now here, we're going for a mo more bulky set. So we got HP defense, just be as bulky as possible. The ability doesn't matter, but I'm using Spellcaster. We got obviously the Hatrix Rune for moves. We got Psycho Force, Fireball, Burning Orb, and Heal. Now, you may be asking, why are you not using Enlightenment? Well, Enlightenment doesn't. You're never going to click Enlightenment. You're just not. You're just not. Burning Orb is just a better option to cripple things like Fruit Toad, Abyssin, basically things that try to swap onto you and beat you. You got Psycho Force. Psycho fi Mind and Fire is like one of the best coverage. No, it's not. That's a lie. But it's like good coverage. So, yeah. Or good stab and a good coverage move. For equips, we got Theater Mask, Vial Tears, Pizza Slice. Literally, these equipments are just to boost defense. And that's all we care about defense. We don't care about speed. Our attack, we still hit really hard. We just care about our defense. Now, for the team. I'm using, unfortunately, one of my least favorite doodles, Fruit Toad. It just worked really well on this team, so I had to. I'm also using this again. Um, it got, I didn't know it got trades, so I'm trying like a trade set with Sapphire. So yeah, I'm just going to pray that works. And let's just get on to the video. And on to the first battle. I was going to say this looks hard, but Awakened Hatrix actually does quite a bit here. Mm. Actually, I don't know. We're going to we're definitely going to need for Gale. For Gale just is so good here. Jirisera is going to be annoying. I just now realize I have no removal for lingering poison, so that sucks. Okay, Hombiscus. Now, I could jet strike. I could. I very well could jet strike. I'm gonna jet strike. Okay, he's smarter than that. Jirisera. This just gives him a free opportunity to click Lingering Poison. I'll just go into Hatrix. Oh. Oh, wait, he didn't click Lingering Poison. Also, we took that really well. Uh. We can click Fireball here. Not much wants to swap onto a Firebug. Other, fireball other than Party Bug. Is it Party Bug? It is, in fact, Party Bug. That's fine damage. Now, I'm gonna go Fruit Toad. If this is Awaken, that is gonna kinda suck. But I think it'll be fine. Okay, it's not Awaken. That's a Web Ball. I ate that really well. Now, what we do is we just click Take Out. Take Out? Into what? I feel like I feel like Farrakadal would be a good swap. Just to do damage. Yeah, because we go into that. Jirisera possibly No. No 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 no. That's not what we do. That's not what we do. That's not what we do. What we do is He goes back in the Jirisera. We go back in the Hatrix. And I click Psycho Force. If he stays in, he's dead. Yeah, okay, he swaps. Into what? Jira being at full HP is annoying, but he hasn't set up lingering, so that's, that's fine. Okay. We can just go Montour. Yeah, let's go Montour. 
Oh, what did he click? You gotta be kidding me. Uh. Huh. I don't have much for this. It's kind of hoping that it would get paralyzed. But it didn't, so that sucks. I just need Chip. If he sets up Lingering, that's really good. That's fine for me. No, he clicked Chemical Cleave, predicting something. I have no idea what he was trying to predict, but he was predicting something. Rusty Root, okay. Completely fine. Lower his defense. Then, I go into Fregale. And then, I nosedive. Or I don't nosedive, and he swaps out into what? Oh, this is a great swap, what? I just nosedive. No, I don't. I hit and run instead. Because... This is a really hard battle. Oh, never mind. Alright, on to the next battle. Alright, on to the next battle. This doesn't look that hard, but then again, there's a Rotera. It's gonna be annoying. We'll lead off with Wyvernal this time. Wyvernal was a good lead. Okay. So... I think the best play is just a hit and run. Yeah. Abyssin, Abyssin. Didn't get the burn, unfortunately. But, we'll go on the Ferrocoddle. And, what I can do with Ferrocoddle is... Nothing really stops me from clicking Vine Grasp. So, we click Vine Grasp. And we do a ton of damage to the Rotera, almost killing it. Okay. <laughs> That's crazy. And go into Montour. He hits and run. Yeah, that stun. Yeah, rip Rotera. <laughs> yeah, Farrakhan is just a little strong. Now, this. Hmm. You could just, I I can just go into this and pray it isn't venom punch or poison punch. It probably is poison punch. Yeah, this is one of the problems I have. It's probably venom punch or poison punch. It is not. It just swapped. Shut it. Oh, I outspeed this. I probably shouldn't have clicked that. Okay, never mind. He, if this wait, if this is Shadow Lurk, that sucks. What did I just say, <laughs> bro? Ugh, I hate this. All right. How do we do this? What is this gonna do? Oh, it's def- Oh, no. <laughs> I kinda wanna go into... Ferrocoddle. And just... Feral Fury. Yeah. The best. Oh, it just take out. Okay. It's probably Rotera. Yep. Oh, 
Getting hat tricks onto the field is really important, but I can't really do that when there's like. Okay, prickles, yep. Yeah. I really don't know how to beat this team. I'll just go into hat tricks. Okay, ate that well, ate that well. I go into hat tricks and I awaken. I burning orb. Now I have to pray I don't miss burning orb. And I hit the. That? That is huge. <laughs> That is so huge. What? Letting me burn this. That's actually really huge for me. Um. I just go in the Montour. And you can't do anything. That's actually huge. Really huge for me. That's actually crazy. Okay. Okay, okay. Um. Prickles? Ooh. Now this opens up a lot. I jet strike here. Yep. That opened up a lot. Nice misclick. Okay. So Hatrix already did a lot for the team. Literally just so much work for the team already. Oh, it's clumsy swing. That kind of terrifying. I need this alive though for actually I don't really need it for abyssant. But I would like to keep this alive in general. Yep. I'll just go on the fruit head. What did it click? Oh. Leaf blade, okay. Eh, I'm take out. Okay, that's fine. Completely fine. Because I could just go into this. Hit and run. This is definitely max speed. Yep. I don't really need this around. So, Fairy Fury. Oh. Um, okay then. <laughs> okay, I'll take, I'll take, I'll take basically killing Abyssin. I'll take it, I'll take it. Why does that do so much? This is obviously Fiery Slash, or Iron Slash. I lived. Then he goes into Gineco, right? Yeah, Gineco. This is definitely specs. It really depends on when he clicks, though. Soul fire.
Yep. Oh, I misclicked again. Awaken Hatrix is getting all of the usage right now. Prickles. Uh, we'll just Psycho Force. Doesn't matter if it kills or not. Oh. It doesn't. Okay. He 100%. Yep. I take him out. Yeah, Wicked Hatrick's got a lot of usage. Like, burning the, Arth the Archipos. Really good for me. It gets a magical attack. Okay. He has to click Soulfire. If he clicks Boo, he loses to Fregale. Oh, he left the server. I'm just gonna screw shit. Okay, on to the next battle. Alright, this is the last battle, and honestly... Awakened Hatrix actually looks good here. Like, we can... We can cripple a lot of stuff. Yet again, another Lingering Poison user that's gonna suck the fight against. But, we're kinda free to just to spam Dark Blast. And... And we can also trade, we can trade a lot of things. So, I think a good lead would be for Gale. Unless it's Polar Geist lead. It is a Polar Geist lead, unfortunately. So, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to go into Fruit Toad, actually. And, yeah, okay. I'm going to go into Fruit Toad just to get some momentum. What did he click? Cone of Cold. If that is Specs, it doesn't do a lot of damage. We take out here. No point in belching, because that's not going to do anything. Any point of damage on this thing, its trade is gone, so that's good. It goes into this. Completely fine. Because we can just go into Fair Coddle. And honestly... Fine Grasp is so free. It's so free. Only thing I want to swap in is Grufflin. Oh my god. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Yo. Faracult getting some work done. I really want to misprint Hidden Trait Faracult. I'm going to try to get it from the event. But no, it's just I don't think so. But dude. <laughs> Taking out the Infernius, that's crazy. Like, actually. Alright, Grufflin, party's over. We go into Montour, he's probably Awakened, unless his Awaken is Cerebopod. What did he get? I wasn't paying attention. What did he click? Nosedive? He didn't run. Aw, uh, he didn't get the thing. Clangatang, obviously. We love, we all love Clangatang. Alright. We go on the Fruit Toad. It dis Rust destroys Clangatang, which is very good for us. What did he click? Did you click Disarm? Dark Slash. Okay. Now, I'm gonna hope that he thinks a Rust is coming out, so I'm just gonna take out. Nah, okay. That sucks. I'm actually gonna see how much damage Ferricoddle does. Oh my god. You know what? Taking out the Klingatang. That's a score. That's really good for us. 
so now we awaken we fireball and we are good we got like three we got technically three walls for polar geist now a basin comes in what never mind polar geist just oh okay then polar geist just it's just dead <laughs> What just happened? That... That was definitely a play of all time. Hmm. Okay. Grufflin. We go into... Goes in the Grufflin. Go in the Montour. He can't really hit me. What do you click? Take out. Okay, that did a bit more damage. I think we're good. Because Cerebopod comes- Or no, not Cerebopod. Cerebopod might come in, though. A little too late for Cerebopod to come in, though. Yeah, he just swaps in this. I'm just gonna see if Mineral Cannon kills. It does not kill. Alright. We'll go on the Wyvernal. Just wrap it up. And pray that he doesn't go into... Pray that he doesn't click any other move. Yep. This is a free hidden run. Meltdown... We spam Psycho Force. Okay, we click Psycho Force again. Awaken Hatrix is balling. Yep, he's dead. Okay. That is a magical defense. Wait, do I have higher attack than? Oh yeah, I. Oh my god, I definitely do. All right, we go into this every single time. Oh yes, crush. Oh, he also has that. Okay. He has range defense. I'm gonna shock therapy. I kind of hope he goes before me. Okay, that's fine. To be honest, I just need Grufflin gone. Okay. This is fine, because I could just click Mineral Cannon without worrying about Klingatang swapping in. I think for Gale, just one shot to everything. I'm definitely dying here, though. Which is completely fine. What is he going to? Clangatang. We go in the Hatrix. I think we just win with Hatrix. We just win with Hatrix. We fireball. That's dead. We can just click. Fireball and this should just kill. Yep. Yep. That was a really good game for Awaken Hatrix. Like back to back games with Awaken Hatrix being being like good. That's actually insane. Oh nice crit. Alright. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please consider liking and subscribing. It's free. You don't have to though. I sound like an average YouTuber. But I hope you guys enjoy your day and peace.